a little pep talk if you don't know what pep talk is shame on you man pep talk is wait let me google it <laughs> pep talk a brief intense and emotional talk that is aimed to encourage and influence the audience so i'm just here to encourage you guys and you know like give you guys a little whatever whatever but anywho if this is the first time you're meeting this bold beautiful unapologetic baby girl you are welcome to our youtube channel you are going to fall in love with us all you have to do is to subscribe and hit on the notification button so that when i post you get notified and you run here and you don't miss anything <laughs> Hey, I'm fast, eh? but not faster than your man. We are and Kuruganga and Kimbia. Anywho, if you are a returning subscriber, Conti, I love it. That's why I'm on this app. That's what I'm here for. Consistency. Let me go there and know. Continue, baby girl. I love it because of you i love you and thank you for coming back make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and write down below that you are a returning subscriber if you are a returning subscriber <laughs> so this whole pep talk is going to be about things that i generally think we are supposed to really normalize like let's just normalize it okay because we are human beings and that is going to contribute to our mental health number one can we all just accept getting no when someone tells you a no, don't go um, down their throats. Why? Why? They're already struggling to say the no. Because it's normally so hard to tell people no, by the way. It's so hard. Someone can literally just say yes just to please you. Because they don't want to say, you know, it's in a, when you ask someone, what do you think about this? Do you like it? And they say no. What do you need the why for? why why don't you like it why no are you going to come for tonight's party no what no i don't want to come say okay it's okay is there um in any way can i help are you okay um if there's something that is wrong i would love to know and not why like just accept it I, please that is why most people will lie to you because they know you are going to expect an answer so they are like okay let me just say yes and they will not do it are you going to do it yeah i'll do it they will not do it because they know so well if they tell you no i'm not going to do it you're going to come with a why 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 normalize accepting no without expecting a reason at times the no is just an answer on its own do you want to come no i don't want to come i don't have a reason i just don't want to come i'm so busy doing hot girl shit i want to go and sleep do you want to come no i don't want to come oh okay thank you it would have been fun but it's okay i respect your decision so no do you want to come? no let's break up no why <laughs> number two on the list of things that we are supposed to normalize is normalize outgrowing people just normalize it we don't have to be friends simply because you used to be my classmate in baby class may i know you it's it's not making sense if we have outgrown each other life has happened we have taken different paths and we are doing different things it's cool we are not enemies just outgrew each other life happened and we went to different directions not like oh we squeeze and young Alicia kuna madara kwa sababu yeye ni engineer no girl no and you to normalize when people outgrow you i mean it's okay even in in a relationship maybe it gets to a point where you outgrow each other i'm just fight you guys haven't fought you guys haven't disagreed you've just decided to take different paths you guys don't love each other anymore understand that and move on normalize outgrowing each other and normalize being outgrown be it friends be it family be it cousins be it sisters be it whatever it's it's okay and it's normal when people outgrow that is why most relationships are, are very toxic and are dead but people are still there when a pigana they want to kill each other why these people outgrew each other long time ago but because of oh my god we've been here for for five years we just can't work out me and work out even if it's 56 years <laughs> if if we have outgrown each other I want you all to normalize is self-validation. 
privacy. Just be private without seeking other people's approval and validation. This is because if you validate yourself first, their validation is not going to matter. Whether they validate you or not, it's not going to matter. But if you seek other people's validation first, your own validation is not going to matter. Like, if you are the type of person who will post everything on the gram and really, 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 really obsessed with the like, chances that you are not going to be happy are very high. Why? Because uh, the internet already has told you if you don't get this number of likes, then you are not good enough. And that thing is very addictive, guys. I am telling you as someone who has experienced it, it's very, very addictive. It's going to act like the serotonin and dopamine hormones. These are feel good hormones that are, that make you really feel good and really, really exhilarate your mood and make you feel like, yeah, 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 yeah. So if the social media acts as dopamine in your body, you are going to be addicted to it. I mean, wait, wait a minute. Did you guys just hear my biology? Hey. You can see that our, the, the bright is very future. So guys, all these serotonin and dopamines are going to make you, like now the social media, we are comparing the social media to those hormones. They are going to make you feel good and you are going to always get stuck trying to validate yourself based on the lenses of social media. You get it? So you are going to feel like if I get, let's say 10,000 likes, man, this picture is dope. But if this picture gets like 1,000 or two likes, then it's not dope. You get it? So I want you guys to normalize validating yourself post a picture without looking at the likes like post it and say whatever it is what it is whether it gets two likes whether it gets one like it's mine i mean maybe you've posted the picture and they died out of shock the picture was so good that the people died because like it was too good to be true <laughs> you gotta cheer yourself up and validate yourself without seeking validation based on social media, based on what people say on social media. Four, normalize standing out and being different. Like just be different, be you, be unique, be out there. Normalize not being like everybody. And this is something that I normally like tell my sister all the time. At times, not everything that is trending you're supposed to jump on because can you just stand out? At times those things are crazy. Like there are some fashion that will come in and you see people wear and you're like, Aish. like are you putting it on because you like it or are you putting it on because it's easy and you want to like uh, you want to join the bandwagon of yeah i'm putting on we easy wheezy we let me seem wheezy can you all normalize taking up space and being the best versions of yourself just being out there and being the bad bitch that you are because i'm telling you beyonce didn't start out when she said run the world we do girl we do girl because you are a queen you know you deserve it all don't um shrink yourself don't make yourself smaller just to fit in some bags and just to fit in some space of people i don't know if it's getting here and getting here and getting out bring it back let it get here and stay normalize taking up space and just being who you are you know be who you me i'm noisy and that's it i don't care if they're poor out there who don't like people who are like me i do my stuff i run my shit as long as it's bringing me money and giving me the bag and i'm comfortable with it i mean why not why not normalize being you like normalize being at the very top you get it anyone who thinks oh you're too much wrong audience wrong audience the same way anyone who says oh gushi is expensive is the wrong audience it's not for you baby girl that gushi is not for you quenda toka 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 if you think it's too expensive oh my god i can't put on gushi it's too expensive it's not for you gikomba is open 24 7 for you bend down select to market it's there for you waiting for you and finally finally normalize not adding people on whatsapp group without their consent it's crazy even with their consent just don't add people in whatsapp group most so easy contributions ah guy 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 you just be chilling and then you pop 
Mzee Kalito's typing. And you're like, Mzee Kalito? The topic, Kanye the 74 contribution. And you're like, w w what am I doing here now? What is this? So you ask, oh, why? you like DM the admin and they tell you, oh, do you remember John? I said, John? You don't remember John? John used to be your baby class eat mate. You used to eat together in baby class, but you two didn't like each other like that. And it's been like 52 years ever since you guys saw each other. And now John's mom, who is John's sister and John's cousin, together with the auntie, just passed. And you're like, God damn it. You don't know John. You don't know the mom. Oh, oh, excuse me. I am that lady that said hi to you at the shop. And now I've added you in our group. It's crazy. Please, let's normalize not adding people in those groups. It's, it's crazy. It's... Thank you. Please don't add me in any WhatsApp group. Usiniweke kwa WhatsApp group yoyote. Usiniweke kwa WhatsApp group yoyote. Kwa sabo mimi siyo WhatsApp. Usini... Don't add me in any WhatsApp group. WhatsApp. Don't add me. We'll be typing CG. What won't let us contribute? She will, she needed us. Hey, anywho, that's it for our pep talk, guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, yeah, normalize everything that I've said in this, whatever. I normalize liking my videos even before watching them, and normalize giving this video a big thumbs up, and normalize sharing it. Until next time, guys, I love you all so, so much. And it, it, it. Uh -uh. You don't laugh, finish, you just want the wrong go. No, now, press that red button to subscribe. Yes, yes, that red button, press and to subscribe. Now, yeah, press that bell. That school bell, press and press and to the get a notification. Hey, 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 now, if you do go, thank you, thank you. A lawyer.